And we're back with the men's minus 54 final between James Howe and Melvy Alvarez. And if it's anything like the minus 58 kilogram final, we're going to have a great one here. This is the savvy veteran in Howe who's been around on the team for many, many years against the up and coming junior in Melvy Alvarez. Alvarez in the red. Howe in the blue. Nice idea by Howe just to try to kick underneath, but Alvarez did a good job. Oh, inside, inside by Alvarez very quickly. James Howe trying to punch there. Alvarez does a good job with his right leg inside. Nice idea for Haynes to come over with the back leg, just long to the body. Alvarez, lots of credit with that cover there. Good, big defensive rounds kick. Alvarez does a good job moving through it, keeping the arm down, and get, garnering himself a point with the deduction by Howe for falling. Big punch there. Alvarez showing the left-hand punch. And, Al, and James Howe showing a little disgust. He didn't think that should score. And there's a snapping body shot. Wow, a nice snapping body shot by Alvarez. And almost a head kick, too. So a little bit of a surprise start here for the young, very energetic Melvy Alvarez. That's another shot, well, and a body shot. So he scores the cut, throws the hard punch. Doesn't get the point, but he's up to 8-0 now. So a little bit of surprise here as the, the, the veteran James Howell kind of getting caught. Big left hand over the top punch. Easy score there. Takes it to 9-0. Inside, there's the inside right again. So kind of catching James Howell a little bit off balance with that lunging in with his right leg and then switching his feet inside and throw it inside. Almost a switch in, if you will. And then a right leg inside, rotated over body around his kick. 11-0. Big cut kick. James Howe looking for the defense around his kick. Oh, and, and got his arm cut. Caught, caught up in the arm. Had the good leg control to come over the top with a little flip right on his kick to the face. And that's, that's a tough call. James House trying to throw his foot out. Got himself a little bit off balance. Takes a deduction for not kicking with his leg up. Oh, that's a big right leg. Just switches his feet, kicks that right leg. James Howell, right now, no answer. This is a little bit of a stunner. As the veteran James Howell in a big hole at 19-0. James Howell having, having a hard time reading the punch. And without question, he just can't get his arms down quick enough when Alvarez switches inside and throws his right leg to the body inside. So, so again, a little bit of a shock on the other side. No, Alvarez. In firm control here, can he keep that control for two more rounds with James Howell, who's tons of experience, really gutsy fighter. Again, one of the best athletes to come out of USA Taekwondo as far as longevity in a really long time. Can he, he'll find his way back. If anybody can, it would be James Howell. So round two coming up, James Howe has his own school now in California. It's called Living Proof Taekwondo, and he's having a ton of success. And why would he not? Because he, what an engaging elite athlete that who wouldn't want to train with this guy, James Howe. He's going to have to work himself out of this big hole. Can he do it? Alvarez with a nice 19-0 lead over James Howe. Good, good start for Howe as he's just going to continue to press that hard cut. Oh, there's the right leg again, and right now that's the difference. James Howe can't seem to get his arm down quick enough, and Alvarez is having enjoying a ton of success with a little bit of the left and then a little bit of the right there, and then what does he do? He gets inside, he either punches with his left hand, like there, or he'll switch after that and kick with his right. Yeah. 
That's a snapping cut, and Hal looking for the defense. Nice spin. Wow. Maybe I was, was able to contact the headgear there. And this is getting a little bit out of control, and I'm a little surprised by it. Yeah, that's a push. He pushed the, the player out of bounds. So that's a deduction for James instead of on the other side for Alvarez falling down. But right now, it's just a, the look on uh, some of the athletes' faces that are watching this are a little bit surprised. As you just, James Howe is so veteran and so crafty, just not able to reach Alvarez today. Just a tad bit off here in the finals. Big 360 rounds kick. That's going to be two more points. So I'm a little surprised the referees didn't get that. They'll get it now, though. So they're going to – that's a nice 360 rounds kick. James Howe turning the flow. Good. So they they check it, make sure that they they that this point came off of the the turn 360, not a ball and roundhouse kick. It does. So James Point is going to be added two more points. So that's excellent for him, as he kind of kind of stems the tide and gets himself on the board here, with about 40 seconds left in round number two. Can he stop this left hand punch? And he's he's got his right leg in front now, so this could be a better better chance for him. Wow, and that's gonna that should be worth more points there because that was a defensive turn. Now he's gonna get a deduction for not fighting. He turned his back. Yeah, he did. Oh, and he's gonna try, he's gonna call him for turning his back as he was kicking. Therefore, the points aren't gonna score. Good inside Reynolds kick by Alvarez doesn't score, but but again. Great backside, Reynolds kick. Doesn't score, but again, shutting down the turn of James Howe. He can't spin when he goes into the backside, so maybe not scoring, but definitely shutting down some of the things that James Howe does absolutely great. So exciting times for Manuel Alvarez. Coming here, having a ton of success here. He's got one more round to go, so this is a long way from over. But a great opportunity for him as he's a resident athlete here. Just selected recently, coming off of his junior Pan Am Games Team trials win. Therefore, he'll have an opportunity not just to compete here, but train here and an opportunity to, to do this with other elite athletes like himself in this resident athlete program. So great opportunity for Melvin Alvarez. And, and, and you out there, you have that opportunity as well. If you have some success and, and you can do this at a high level, well, then, of course, USA Taekwondo wants you. So round three of this men's under 54 kilogram Fenway final winner moves on to team USA and a spot on the team that will compete at the Pan American championships early June in Cancun. Here we go. Round three, 22 point lead for Alvarez and Hal starts to round off nicely with a snapping round of kick cut kick that scores looks for the spin hook kick. So James Hal doing the right thing, but that's, this is good trade, but James Howe can't do this. This is not good for him. I like that he's doing it, but he's he will lose that exchange nine out of ten times because Alvarez inside right is just world class. So it's not something that as much as I like, but James Howe is, is coming back here. He's starting to come back. Oh, there's a nice cut kick from Alvarez that scores. 
Good axe kick there by Howe. Just good spin by Howe as well. Well, Alvarez is, is just, his scoring efficiency is through the roof right now. As every other kick seems to score for the talented Melvi Alvarez. Nice cut kick there. James Howe looking for the spin. He's a tiny bit late. So that's a three-point score for Al Melvi. Gets the cut kick point. Gets the deduction point. Takes it to 41-14. And, you know, barring a knockout, Melvi Alvarez is going to move on. So James Howe is going to be looking for a lot of face shots. So expect to see some spins to the face. Expect to see some roundhouse kicks to the face. Expect to see a lot of those home run type swings, if you will, from James here late with 30 seconds left to try to get himself a win that way. Alvarez doing a good job of, of tacking just to keep James Howe from – pushing forward and setting up that big kick. Nice try by Howe there. Almost took it right to the face, right down the middle. And again, that's what you're going to expect here. It's going to be looking for those face kicks. Good spin there. Nice idea by Alvarez. He just drops his head. Says, I'll swing for one for you. But it is. It's today is Melvin Alvarez's day as he takes out the the elite champion in James Howe. And there it is. There you have it. It is Melvin Alvarez, the minus 54 kilogram champion here today at the National Center of Excellence. And it is an impressive, an impressive win. No shame for James Howe. He's not only has he done this at the highest level, but he's a super classy guy. So he'll he'll congratulate the young Alvarez. But there you have it. That is the end of this session. We're going to come back with more.